Case of deja vu, and not the good kind either, a Nanaimo guitar store with an inventory of high-end items has been pilfered by thieves. The same scene that played out three years ago. Jessica Lepp goes back to the scene of another crime. Well, oh, this is uh, the, the hole in... It's a uh, site that has left wall. a gaping hole in the heart of an Nanaimo businessman. Yeah, so this is uh, here where they went through the wall and uh, did the damage to the drywall there. After breaking into the electrical room of Arbutus Music and cutting the alarm system early Saturday morning, store owner Richard Layton says thieves managed to break and crawl through a wall, avoiding video surveillance and entering into the business's storage room. Immediately I start running through in my mind of, okay, we've got to start trying to figure out like what and any sort of holes, as we call them, on the wall, see what's missing. It was in here that six instruments were taken, including some vintage and extremely rare guitars and a personal favourite of Layton's. A 1959 Les Paul special, which is... Not a common guitar. Some Hofners from the 50s, which are unique, and, and, and a, a 1916 Martin Rolando, which is, they only made 153 in 1916, and of that model, they only made about 40, so it's a pretty rare guitar. Also stolen was this eye-catching 1962 National Westwood. The model is the Westwood 77. It was nicknamed the map of the U.S. That's meant to look like the eastern seaboard, with that being Florida right there. Leighton figures in total, the burglary has left him without at least $50,000 worth of gear, and this isn't the first time. In 2014, thieves pried open the front door, making off with $46,000 worth of instruments. We're a unique store, and we care a lot of unique unique instruments. Mounties say this heist was brazen but not uncommon. It's not uncommon. Electrical rooms are often breached and uh, often they're not alarmed. RCMP say should any of the guitars stolen end up in pawn shops, the public can lend a hand. The high-end ones will be a uh, specialty market. We'll try to sell them privately and uh, hopefully we'll get a tip on that. The criminals also made off with a credit card which was used at other businesses in Nanaimo. Officers are following up on these leads hoping to obtain surveillance footage and find out who is responsible. Jessica Lepp, CTV News, Nanaimo.